Hi guys, this is Adamia from Digit and I have with me Anshuman who is the founder of Reticence, the maker of these smart insoles that are called Stradalizer. And Anshuman is going to today tell us all about how Stradalizer functions. So Anshuman, take it away. Hey Adamia, so thank you very much for the introduction. Um, what we are trying to do is, while there are a lot of fitness gadgets out there that essentially track what people do in their fitness activity, we wanted to go a step further and build a, essentially a virtual coach which can then monitor what a person is doing and whether it's appropriate good for them, it's good for them and how can they improve in what they are doing. Right? So let's just take runners for example. Uh, although running is a very very simple sport, we see on an average that about 60% of, runner, of the runners would get injured in a year. Right? So what can we do about them? The idea is that we have built a pair of smart soles which, uh, which have sensors in them and then we also have an app that actually uses the data from the sensors and it has an intelligence behind it to understand what's going on with a person's running to be able to essentially act like a virtual coach for them. Okay, so the insoles have sensors and they're going to give me data about the way I'm running and that data is available to me on the smartphone app? Yes, it's available to you everywhere. It's available to you on the smartphone or if you want to lo look at it at your computer, you can just log on to our website and take a look at the data, do all the analysis, share with So uh, how do the smart soles, insoles, sorry, uh, connect to the smartphone app? Yeah, so these insoles have a Bluetooth chip in it. So. Uh, when you start running, they automatically turn on and then from your app, you can then connect to them. We can just do a, like a very, very quick demo. So for example, we see that, let's suppose if you want to just connect one insole, it's, if you just put some motion into the insoles, it's gonna connect. And we see that this insole is connected now. So both of them are now connected. And then the athlete or the runner can then just go move forward and then start their activity, right? So we'll just say, let's say, we start the activity and the personnel can now start running. This is just uh, any sim any uh, running uh, app would have this kind of a screen where they basically show basic tracking information. Uh, so what kind of information does it give the runner? What are so the statistics that it gives the runner? So for example, it essentially shows to you to the runner as they're running real time, where are they experiencing what kind of stress. So if I'm striking, or if I'm running in a way so that I strike heel first, then I would have a lot of stress on my heel and then it would essentially have, a, you know, stress uh, moving up the body as well. Okay, so could you tell us about uh, what kind of feedback does uh, the insole provide the user in terms of uh, how they should run and how their posture should be? Yes, so the insoles uh, have a lot of data that they collect about the movement of the person's foot and the body, right? So what we can tell the user is, are they uh, off balance? Let's, for example, like they're putting more pressure on the left side of the body versus the right side of the body. Um, are they striking the ground in a way that is causing them too much, uh, you know, jerks on their, you know, bone structure or things mm -hmm. like that? Are the stress distributed uniformly, or are they accumulating a lot of stress in one part of the body? So, how did the idea of Stradalizer come about? Are you a runner yourself? Are yes, you a passionate yes. runner, and that's why, and probably you were running all wrong all this time? <laughs> yes. So, I think uh, most runners go through this phase, and uh, you know, we all suffer all kinds of injuries throughout our running career. And I have been a runner uh, myself for about 13, 14 years. Okay, that's and, great. Uh, it's, it's essentially something that we runners just take as part of life, but it doesn't have to be that way. Right? So, what uh, I've had my own share of injuries, uh, from simple minor injuries, aches and pains, to you know, some extreme ones. For example, I have a torn ACL on my oh. left leg. Right? Okay. So, this is something that is definitely very close to my heart, uh, okay. other than being my passion. So, I definitely feel the pain, literally, of other runners who have gone through injuries and problems and want to do something. Uh, for them. Right. So, have you sold to any famous runners yet? Is Usain Bolt wearing the <laughs> stratalizers? So, Usain Bolt is not, uh, <laughs> but I think there are, so there are a whole bunch of uh, international level users of our product. There is a silver medal winner Olympic racer as well, mm -hmm. who uses our uh, stratalizer technology in his 
uh, training program. So the data from the app must be helping uh, when they're getting coached as well, right? Yes. To to share that data with their coach and you know Absolutely. to improve their posture as well. Absolutely. Okay, so you're gonna now show us a demo of the stabilizer, and I'm gonna shoot that. As you can see, while we are running around, it, it, you can the users can get like a live. Uh, map of where the stress is distributed, where they are accumulating the, the maximum amount of stress on both the foot as well as the knee. Right? And they can use this data to understand how their run is impacting them. So uh, could you tell us how does it determine uh, the stress points in the feet and the knee? What is the tech behind it? Yes. So in our insole, if, if you just look at the insole, we have sensors all throughout the insole. Right. Okay. And based on where the user is putting uh, a where significant amount of stress and how the user is moving their feet and moving that sig the maximum stress point forward, we can then estimate how the user uh, is actually moving their complete leg mm -hmm. through our analytics in the app. And using that, we then calculate what kind of stress distribution is there on the person's foot as well as the person's knee. Okay, and tell us about the price of the Stratalyzer and how do I buy one if I have to buy one in India? So, Stratalyzer is priced at around $139 uh, and that's about 8,000 rupees in India. And so, do you think that's a little expensive for the Indian market? I mean, are people actually paying it grand for insoles? Yeah, so it's definitely something that people are, you know, definitely interested and in. people are buy buying in some of these kind of devices. It's not too expensive if you look at what it does. Right? Essentially, it acts like a virtual coach for you. And most times, if you're trying to prepare for a marathon or if you're trying to prepare for a fitness um, activity, uh, some event, you would hire a coach to guide you. But this is a coach that's available with you, 